All right. All right. So let's move into the drivers now. Okay. So again, preface this with there's 20 drivers. The bottom half can usually just, you can throw out a name against a, a wall and see what sticks. And yeah. you know every race it changes, reliability issues with some of those lower teams. So we're going to just focus on the top 10, the ones that we think can compete. Mm -hmm. All okay? right. Yep. All right. So, so starting with number 10. Yep. I have Alonzo. I have Vettel. Okay. So we're going against old world champions against each other. Yeah. So, I mean, but you have Alpine ahead. Yep. And I have Aston ahead. So I think that's why we both have... Yeah. Number 10. Yeah, there. that makes sense. So. All right. We'll see. So, number 9. Ricardo. Ricardo. Yeah. Yeah. I don't again, like we said in the in the constructor, he's pretty con if he gets consistent, he'll probably be a little bit higher, but again, he's going to go from winning a shoey and or winning Monza and having a shoey to not even finishing in, you know, a lot of the other races. So. Yeah. So, and yeah, and like qual he's I don't know, he's, he's hit or miss. Yeah. I don't know. He's he's all over the place, but I love watching him. Yeah, he's I fun. love his interviews. Too. Honey Badger. Oh, I love him. All okay. right, number eight. Um, I think we have the same. Gasly. I have Gasly. Yeah. Okay. So we do have the same for Gas. Okay. All right. Yeah. So eight again. Kind of talked about it a little bit. Yeah. Um, he's definitely the points bringer of AlphaTauri. Yeah. So. so I mean, they give him a good car. He gets in a good position. And I mean, we've seen him like bring the fire. So. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. So seven. I think, I think we're I'm going here. with, I'm going to go with Russell. Russell. Yes. It's a bold pick. It is. I know. You're okay. uncomfortable with that pick. I am. I don't, <laughs> so I don't know. Cause I f feel like the person that you have here. I have Perez. Okay. Here. So I kept flip flopping them. Okay. Kind of like we were doing with Vettel and Alonso. Yeah. Because I was like, you know, Russell wants to prove himself, but is it going to be like, kind of like a when Gasly moved to a Red Bull situation, is going to be like too much pressure. I don't know. Is, or is it wait your turn while Hamilton wins? Yeah. Like yeah. you have to play because Hamilton wants that eighth title yeah. so bad. Mm -hmm. Are you going to have to be a team player, prove yourself, and then they'll promote you? Yeah. So I, but I, yeah, I'm going with seventh. Yeah. That's fair. But I'm, I'm, I think, I think we're going to see a win from him this year. So. Yeah. That was one of our bold predictions, I think. Um, in that, in that video, you haven't checked it out. Yeah. Uh, I have Perez. Again, I think he's a great driver, I, but I think he knows he's a second. And I know that's sad because he's a great driver, but like, Red Bull's never going to prioritize him over Max. And there's so many teams with McLaren improving, Ferrari improving, Mercedes being dominant. There's just so many drivers now at the top that I think he's going to be the one that gets kind of... Yes, but like, just because Max, they prioritize winning, they're still like, okay, Perez, get second. Like If he can, or what if he gets on a... They set him in for a pit stop like they did this time for soft tires, and he loses all those places because they had to steal the point away from Hamilton or something. Yeah, but I feel like Red Bull's going to want that. Like, they got that driver last year. Yeah. They want that constructor's name. But again, I had Red Bull third. That's you true. Okay, second. okay, okay. So. We're just, we're just going to be a house divided. <laughs> all season house yes. divided. Um, all right, so six. sixth. I had Norris. I have Norris, too. Yeah. Consistent. Um, consistent. Uh, I just There's just so many good drivers. Yes. Yeah. And I mean, who knows with this new car? But yeah, exactly. I, yeah, so yeah, yeah. I think that's. And then it. my bold prediction was he was going to be the one that didn't get a, his first win. Mm -hmm. So again, I think that's kind of speaks to sixth with oh, McLaren being fourth. No. I hope I'm wrong. I do. I love Norris, but like, I just think again, there's so yeah. there's only so many races. You still have Hamilton. You still have Max. And if we think Ferrari's as good as we think yeah. they are, they're going to get some wins. Russell's going to get a win. You know, there's always that weird race where like Ocon won, right? I mean, there's 23 races. Can't we just give a win to them all? <laughs> <laughs> All right, moving on. Five. Okay, I think we're probably opposite. I said Perez. I said Russell. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So, so it's kind of the same reasons. Yep. I'm not going to go into it. Yeah. All right. Here, here we go. This Here's is when it gets controversial again. To... This is when you get all the hate mail. I know. Okay. Fourth. You go, because mine's going to piss you off to high heaven. Probably. Probably divorce. Probably. Probably. All right. Cool. At least we know it. You guys saw it here first. Breaking news. Um, I had Sans. I have Leclerc. Divorce. <laughs> um, yeah, I think Sainz is a great driver. Mm -hmm. I think he, you know he's really consistent. He got all the podiums last year for Ferrari, except for Silverstone. Mm -hmm. um, I think he's going to get his first win this year. Okay. But I think there's three other better drivers. Okay. No, I, I mean that's. I, I mean the, the, our top four, like they're all good drivers, obviously. And again, this is, I remember keep saying this, but this is before testing. Yeah. So if Ferrari gives him a crap car. You know, then or it's it a rocket ship. Yeah, it doesn't yeah. matter. Yeah. Um, I I think Leclerc has what it takes to be a world champion. But 
he just has the most rotten luck <laughs> of any driver. I mean, can yeah. we watch Monaco and not cry? Oh. So, uh, or his first win was after his friend died. Yeah, he just has the most rotten yeah. luck. Yeah, that's true. And I, I, want, yeah. I, I think he has what it takes to be number one, but is it going to happen? I don't know. So. Yeah, that's fair. I'm going with, I'm going with four. All right, so three. Okay. Who's your third driver? So now I'm going to piss off the rest of the world. Um, Hamilton. I also have Hamilton. Okay. He comes back for his eighth title. And I think he finishes third. And I don't think that's going to sit well. No. But but like we said, like these rule changes are usually trying to usher in new people, mm-hmm. new um, constructors. I don't know if the pressure is going to get to him. Probably not because it's Hamilton. But... I don't know. He's one of the. He's statistically one of the greatest drivers of all time. Yeah. So for him, if he comes back and wins his eighth, I don't think either of us are gonna be surprised. Yeah. No. I think we're trying. This is not like hopeful because we don't like Hamilton. I think this is hopeful because like it's fun to see someone new win. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, and, everyone likes an underdog. Yeah, and I think, you know, eventually he's got to have diminishing returns, right? Like Schumacher couldn't do it when he was in his forties. Hamilton's gonna be thirty-eight, I think. Yeah, thirty. Thirty-seven, thirty-eight, something okay. like that. Yeah. So like eventually. That's true. You're going to, yeah. like Jordan even, mm-hmm. you know, all the guys eventually get a little worse. And I think Russell's going to take points away from him. Okay. Yeah, that's true. So, we'll see. All I don't right. Know. Okay. Number two. Number two. Sons. Sons. Yes. Okay. Okay. And then I have Max Verstappen. Okay. Do you want to... I don't. Say anything about There's that? nothing I can say. Everyone's just going to be like, oh, you know, he has Leclerc first because he's a fanboy. And to quote Matt from WTF1, I'm not a fanboy, I'm just passionate. Yeah, a little bit. He has a I, sticker of Leclerc on his phone. I do. Oh my gosh, so embarrassing. <laughs> um, so, okay. So I personally have Sons just because he showed up in not Ferrari's best, and he he got took it to Leclerc. Yeah, everyone said Leclerc was going to be number one, and he still may be. I mean, yeah, they need a good car, but. I don't know. I, I really think he's good, and he's he is. Ugh. And I think Ferrari is a big enough team, and they're a legendary enough mm-hmm. team where their one is going to be whoever's going to win the title. Yeah, I like, can't. I can't see them being like, okay, Leclerc's going to win this one. Sans, you better. Yeah. Better no. be wingman. They're going to be like whoever can get Ferrari the yeah. title. That's who we're picking. Yeah. So I, I can see that. But. And then Max is obviously re- repeating it. Mm-hmm. To be the next battle, we have four in a row at Red Bull. Who knows? But yeah. I, I just, I, I don't know. I could see him winning again. He's got all the pressure off him now. He can just yeah, race it's just, for fun. and he like, I mean, you saw him like going into that last race at Abu Dhabi. Like he was, just, I don't know, he was so Ice chill, cold, man. And yeah. I was like, does he want it or is he just like having fun? And so yeah. I think now that he's like number one on his helmet, watch his helmet reveal. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's really um, cool. First time number one's been on the grid since uh, Vettel for Red Bull. So yeah, maybe it repeats. Yeah. Yeah. So I don't know. I think I think he has it in him to bring it home, and he's a great driver. And I think without that pressure, and he's just going to be out there having fun in a new car. Yeah. I don't know. I think I think he has it. So all right. Then, Any yeah. other oh by the ways for your driver standings? Um, I'm trying to think of anyone crazy. I think Schumacher's going to get points, so I don't think he's going to be last. Yeah. But um, yeah, I can't think of anything else really that crazy. No. Again, until testing comes out and yeah, because I mean last shit. year, last year testing Mercedes was like sixth and yeah, everyone's like, oh, yeah. this is it. Yeah, and then they win the title. So who knows? So yeah. after testing, we can, we're going to come back with like our tail between our legs, like oh my gosh. <laughs> oh god, it's going to be a Hamilton repeat and uh, Ferrari's going to finish last. Yeah. So we'll see. So. But I don't know. This is fun. And, yeah. Um, All right. Yeah. Let us know what you think in the comments down below. Uh, who you think is going to win the constructor world title? And who you think is going to be in the driver world title? Yeah. All All right. Right. And any bold predictions for you guys? Comment below. Yeah. Okay. All right. Thanks, everybody. All right. Appreciate it. See ya.